Hey, K1 friends, it's me, Mr. Carity. Guess what I got in the mail today? Your story. So I decided to make a book with it. You were the author. I was the illustrator. What do you think of my drawings? Let me know. One day, Mr. Carity was riding his bike when he saw a big problem. A tiger was missing his favorite ball. The tiger couldn't remember where he left it. Mr. Carity was a detective and knew that he could solve this problem. He asked the tiger if he wanted help. They went to Tiger's house. He looked in Tiger's house and around his yard, but he couldn't find any clues. So he got out his binoculars to help. He noticed a clue. It was a green and white piece of the ball laying in the grass beside a piece of popcorn. Mr. Carity followed the clues all the way to the movie theater. He looked under the screen, but he didn't see another clue. So he looked on the roof. Not there either. Mr. Carity was feeling sad. He was starting to think that he would never solve this mystery. Then he had an idea. He called Tiger and asked him if he had ever been to Turtle's house. The tiger said yes. He asked the tiger to meet him there. The tiger hopped on his orange bike and Mr. Carity jumped on his green bike and they raced to Turtle's house. They both arrived at the same time. They saw a raccoon. They looked on top of it, not there. They looked under it, but still no luck. They looked on the roof. They looked beside the house and even in the backyard. Where could Tiger's missing ball be? Mr. Carity opened his bag of spy gear and found his flashlight. He turned it on and they started to climb the stairs. Together, they lifted the door to the attic and... Inside was Tiger's missing ball! The tiger was so happy! He asked Mr. Carity if he wanted to go and eat some broccoli to celebrate. Mr. Carity was excited. How did Tiger know that broccoli was his favorite food? Mr. Carity solved the mystery and he even got to eat broccoli. Two of his favorite things, but... If you ask him, the best part of his day was making a new friend. Having a friend makes solving mysteries so much fun. The end. Well, K1 friends, how did you like that story? Thanks again for sending it to me. Keep solving mysteries and stay safe.